Morning, everybody. Paul Lee from Paul Lee's Custom Skins here with another tutorial to help you out with your skinning and using Mod Studio 2. Right, so we've got obviously now we've changed how you download the XMLs on Mod Studio 2. So, first of all, make sure you have this folder in your document. Use a vehicle folder. If you don't have that folder in your documents then when you want to download the xmls from the internet on mod studio 2 they won't download so you must have that folder on your computer in your documents so that's the first thing right now the next thing if you want to if you've got a mod that is unlocked so you will open the mod up oh look so hang on now this is uh, Smarty's uh, five star truck he released recently. So you so you would have these normally these files like this if you if your mods unlocked. So basically take them files out there, like that. drag them into your folder that you made on your desktop. So we just made one here, just paste our test. So your lamp and mod studio. Will SCS tools, vehicles, add vehicle, from folder, you then search on your desktop for said folder that I'll just put up wherever it is, paste our test, so it should be paste our test, yeah, then that'll come up then, that's your truck, then you'll add that into your log so into your mod studio, do the necessary stuff that you want to do. Blah blah blah, change the name, this, that, and the other. And that's how you do. If your mod's locked, then you won't be able to do that at all. And if you try to do it from the way we used to do it, and from the mod, let me see if it works here, watch it work now. Saying so nothing shows up. So you must do it from the way I showed you where you've got to basically open the model, put all your files into another folder, a separate folder, and then do it from folder. Uh, that's the way we have to do it now. So hopefully that'll clear a few, a few things up for you guys who are struggling with it a bit. Um, hopefully that's how, that's, if there's anything else you need to know, obviously ask him much if you to Discord, or uh, if you need any more, if you think any more tutorials need refreshing or whatever, then let me know in the on Discord or whatever, and then I'll uh, obviously I'll refresh the videos. The video should be straightforward, to be honest, because I tried to keep it nice and short for you. So hopefully that'll help you. So good luck and speak to you all soon. Take care.